Hi friends, I hope everyone had a wonderful Independence Day weekend. I hope you got to spend lots of time with friends and family, and I hope you got to eat some good food. And of course, I hope you got to see some gorgeous fireworks. As you can probably tell, this video is not going to be about cleaning or organizing or staying healthy or any of that. Well, no, I'll correct myself. Enjoying time away from all of the daily grind and spending time with your family, that is extremely healthy. But you know what I mean. It's good to be structured, it's good to have plans in place, but it's also good to take a break from that every once in a while. To be present in these moments and to be able to enjoy things as they are without worrying and fretting over how productive you're being or what you're not doing. Someone shared a video recently of this sweet lady who was gently giving advice and using her years of wisdom to share these words that really hit home to me. She said, find your joy. Find it in the situation that you're in now. And don't waste your time waiting for things to line up. I'm paraphrasing, of course. And if you know the video I'm talking about, please let me know so that I can give proper credit. But in her words were a gentle warning to not waste our time in the mind frame of I'll be so glad when. And these words really hit home for me. I've been a mom for 14 years and I've been a wife for almost 20. And with these changes I'm making to my mindset this year comes the bittersweet knowledge of knowing how many holidays have passed when I was sitting around saying, I will be so glad when. How many Independence Days did I sit there thinking, man, I would enjoy this so much more if I didn't have such a big mess to go home to? Or looking around at all the ladies with the cute outfits and saying to myself, man, it would be nice to be able to dress up like that and feel good about myself. But I didn't do that this year and oh my gosh, I can't tell you how wonderful it felt to be there in the moment with my family and to not care about the mess at home, not care about what I look like. And for goodness sake, not sit there and ask myself what the point of being happy today was when I wasn't sure if I was going to be happy tomorrow. What you just saw was me at the park with my family, enjoying a pedal boat ride and a snow cone. And then after that, we took my little girl to Lowe's to pick out some paint we're in the middle of redoing her room and yet here we are playing putt-putt and I am just fine with it. I didn't worry about all the furniture sitting everywhere and the fact that we have primer on the wall with no paint. I let my husband film me making a hole in one for the first time in a long time and I didn't even worry about how big my butt looks on camera. He really is the best guy and I'm so thankful for him and my beautiful children. Here we are hanging out at our local Independence Day celebration. This park we go to does it right. There are all kinds of fun activities and goodies to be had. And I gotta say for the first time in a long time, I was able to just sit back, breathe, and enjoy it. The house is still a mess and yes, I'm out of shape, but today I didn't care about any of it. I shared some cotton candy and a funnel cake with my kids. And I just can't stop talking about how good it felt to just be there, soaking it all in. I've got four more summers with my son and nine more with my little girl. And I'm not wasting any more of that time wishing things were this way or that. This Independence Day was the best holiday I've had in my whole entire adult life, I think. And it's only the beginning. For the first time since I can remember, I'm excited about the rest of my life. And I hope whoever hears this can draw some inspiration from my experience and my words. Because when you have that voice in your head saying, I'll be so glad when, it's the most difficult thing in the world to fight it. But if I can do it, so can you. Find your joy, embrace the imperfection, because life is precious, but it's also short. <laughs>